All right, so now that I've got my cover painted, right? So I got my black front and back all clean, ready to go. These pieces of paper, the five and a quarter by eight and a half, these are going to be inside pieces that are going to be like cover sheets, right? So this is the back of the journal. This is the inside of the back, and you can see I pre-cut them so that they make a nice clean edge all the way around. So I've got that one for the back cover. And I've got my other one because, again, my photo is going to go into my window. Now, again, this photo is somewhat abstract, so it doesn't really matter vertical or horizontal. I left a little bit on the top here so that when I tape it in, it'll make it a little bit easier to attach the tape. But you can see when I cut it out, you're going to leave a little bit of white all the way around. When I line this up on the 4x6, all right, that's how it's going to pretty much appear compositionally. But it's not going to stay because I don't have anything on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a piece of framer's tape, and I'm going to put this sticky side on the framer's tape, pointing up. I'm going to lay the photo so that it's half on the tape and half off the tape, just like this. All right, and now I'm just going to take my frame, I'm going to line it up. I don't want the opening to hit the tape. I want it to cover that quarter of an inch or that eighth of an inch on either side that we cut this window smaller. So I can see if I line it up here, I can look on the top and just find the overlap just like that. And then I just press down right there. Okay, now if I pick it up, I just want to smooth this out. And now my photo is taped down on the inside. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my adhesive transfer tape on four corners of this. And I'm going to use the adhesive transfer, put the tape down there, flip this over. And that will act as a seal not only for the inside cover, but it will hold the photo in place. When I open and close the book, it will keep everything together in the photo, which is just hinged in. I don't have to do anything more than just hinging it. The photo will just stay there, and I'll have a nice, clean inside of both pieces of the journal.